Do you remember Berlin from Money Heist? Yes, the same Berlin who was the professor's brother who was also dying of an illness and therefore he sacrifices himself to save the entire gang in the first ever heist of Money Heist. The popularity of Berlin grew so high that now we have a separate series of Berlin. It is a prequel series to the original Money Heist series and has 8 episodes in total, each of around 40 to 45 minutes and you might say that you might have to invest about 6 hours to watch the entire series. But is it worth it? Let's find out in this video. See, whenever there is a spin-off show being made of a certain TV show which was very famous, it is impossible not to compare them both and find similarities and also find something unique about the spin-off series which gives it its own identity. In simple terms, the new series should feel somehow connected to the original series but still have its own identity, its own flavor, its own taste and something unique about itself. If you have seen the original TV series Money Heist, you very much know what to expect. Expect a huge robbery or a heist with a gang of 5 to 6 people who are trained in a certain skill. For example, there is a hacker, there is always a an hacker and there is also someone who can unlock any lock in the world. Yes, then you also have a couple of more people with similar set of skills and of course at the end you have the mastermind, the leader who plans everything to every minute detail and of course there is a backup plan for a backup plan for a backup plan for a backup plan and so on. And yeah, the leader kind of falls in love with the opposition party and nearly sabotages the entire mission the entire heist. Expect the same thing in our new series of Berlin as well but here the love story is kind of the central piece of the whole story and the heist kind of takes a backseat and the heist revolves around the love story and also the events of this heist takes place sometime before Berlin got to know about his illness and therefore he has his whole new gang for the heist and the first three episodes will feel a lot silly like okay this happened then that happened but then things get kind of serious in the fourth episode but then in the fifth episode again it feels like am I watching the same show? Am I watching the money heist prequel? Because all you can see are multiple love stories at the same time and no heist. And that is exactly when I realized that this is the identity of this series. Don't expect this series to be very serious like money heist but still serious enough that it feels like a part of the original series money heist. Yes, there are some heart pounding scenes which will make you sit up straight and watch. Then of course there are some characters which makes very poor decisions and almost gets them caught but somehow they manage to escape. Now this was one of the highlights of the original series and you will get it here as well but in less quantity and of fairly very low gravity. I really like the other characters like the gang members. They share a very nice chemistry with each other which makes you want to spend time with them. You also enjoy their presence. It was pretty much fun to spend time with them and overall I will see if you have seen the original Money Heist you will find this series somewhat similar but also very different. It's a nice take that makes this series not so tense but at the same time it feels it's more about the love story than the heist and there is a specific reason for that as well. For example if you see in Money Heist there are this many engineering techniques to get the gold out and stuff like that and also there is some meticulously planned planning but why because the leader of that heist was the professor and his speciality was to plan everything to the most minute detail. So the whole Money Heist series or La Casa de Papel had the flavor of their leader the professor but here in Berlin series the identity is love. Because remember Berlin was that kind of a character, he was all in for love every time. And therefore his series where he is the leader, it more feels like a romantic love story than the heist. Now one thing which I didn't really enjoy about the series was how quickly they handled everything. Like at the end it feels like Mm, okay, we spent a lot of time in this series, just wrap it up, pack up, let's finish and go home. It feels like that. Now there is one line in the series by Berlin. He says, my dear friends, love is the only thing worth living for. And that sums up the entire series for me. Happy New Year from my side. Thank you so much for watching.